Subscribe to the channel to motivate us to produce several videos and thank you from the bottom of my heart, the Kungsleden Path. The Kungsleden Path, also known as the King's Trail, is a scenic hiking trail in northern Sweden. It stretches for approximately 440 kilometers, 275 miles, from Abisko in the north to Hemavan in the south and passes through some of the most stunning wilderness areas in Sweden. The trail offers hikers the opportunity to experience the beauty of the Swedish Lapland, including pristine lakes, rolling hills, and dense forests, as well as a chance to see indigenous wildlife such as reindeer, moose, and golden eagles. The Kungsleden Path is open year-round, and hikers can choose to hike it in its entirety or in sections, with various huts and shelters along the way for overnight stays. Abisko National Park Abisko National Park is a protected area located in northern Sweden, in the county of Lapland. It covers an area of over 44,000 hectares and is known for its scenic beauty, including the Aurora Sky Station and the famous King's Trail. The park is home to a variety of wildlife, including reindeer, arctic foxes, and numerous bird species, as well as several species of vegetation, such as the arctic birch and lingonberry. It is a popular destination for outdoor enthusiasts, with activities including hiking, fishing, cross-country skiing, and dog sledding. The Gata Canal The Gata Canal is a waterway in Sweden that runs for 190 miles from Stockholm to Gothenburg. It was constructed between 1810 and 1832 and is considered one of the largest civil engineering projects of the 19th century. The canal has a total of 58 locks, 5 lakes, and 2 rivers, and provides a convenient shipping route between the east and west coasts of Sweden. In addition to its practical uses, the Gata Canal is also a popular tourist destination, offering scenic views and opportunities for recreational activities such as boating, fishing, and hiking. The canal is considered one of Sweden's greatest engineering achievements and is a cultural icon of the country. The Kebnekaise Kebnekaise is the highest mountain in Sweden, located in the Swedish Lapland region. It has two peaks, the southern peak being the highest at 6,926 feet 2,111 meters, above sea level. Kebnekaise is a popular hiking destination, with well-marked trails leading to the summit. The mountain is surrounded by the vast and remote landscapes of the Swedish Lapland wilderness, making it a popular destination for outdoor enthusiasts and nature lovers. The area surrounding Kebnekaise is protected as a part of the Kivo Strict Nature Reserve, a UNESCO World Heritage Site. In recent years, the mountain's southern peak has been shrinking due to melting glaciers, but the northern peak remains covered in ice.
Skepshulman Island. Skepshulman is a small island located in Stockholm, Sweden. It is known for its museums and cultural institutions, including the Moderna Musique, the Museum of Far Eastern Antiquities, and the Museum of Architecture. The island is also a popular destination for tourists and locals due to its green spaces and scenic views of the surrounding water and cityscape. The Wooded Cemetery in Stockholm The Woodland Cemetery, Skogskirkegarden, in Stockholm, Sweden is a famous cemetery and a UNESCO World Heritage Site. It was designed by the architects Gunnar Asplund and Sigurd Lorentz in the 1920s and is considered a pioneering example of modernist landscape architecture. The cemetery is known for its integration of natural elements, such as trees and rolling hills, with functional structures like graves and walkways. It is considered a masterpiece of functionalist architecture and is considered an important example of the Scandinavian tradition of park and cemetery design. Sergel Square Sergel Square is a public square in the center of Stockholm, Sweden. It is named after the Swedish sculptor Johan Tobias Sergel, who was born in Stockholm in 1740. The square is a major transportation hub and shopping area, with several busy streets converging there and several large shopping centers nearby. It is also a popular gathering place for tourists and locals, and is home to several public sculptures and monuments. The T Central and Metro station, one of Stockholm's busiest, is located at Sergel Square, making it a convenient starting point for exploring the city. The Megaliths of Ale Ale's Stones, Ale Steiner, is a megalithic monument located in the Swedish province of Scania. The monument consists of 59 large stones arranged in a ship-like formation, with the largest stones forming the bow and stern of the ship. The stones are believed to be over 2,500 years old, and their purpose and exact age remain a mystery. Despite this, Ailes Stones is a popular tourist destination and is considered an important archaeological site. The monument is also considered to be an important example of Scandinavian megalithic architecture and has been designated as a national heritage site by the Swedish government. Tyresta National Park 
Cresta National Park is a protected area located in the Stockholm region of Sweden. It was established as a national park in 1993 and covers an area of approximately 22,000 hectares. The park is known for its diverse forest ecosystems, including old-growth forests, bogs, and lakes, as well as its rich wildlife, such as elk, deer, and various bird species. Tyresta is a popular destination for hiking, fishing, and camping, and is also used for scientific research and environmental education. Gothenburg Botanical Garden The Gothenburg Botanical Garden is a botanical garden located in Gothenburg, Sweden. It was founded in 1923 and covers an area of approximately 43 hectares. The garden is home to over 16,000 different species of plants, including a large collection of exotic plants from around the world, as well as a wide variety of trees and shrubs. Some of the garden's main attractions include a rock garden, a rose garden, and a large greenhouse complex, which houses a range of tropical and subtropical plants. The Gothenburg Botanical Garden is a popular destination for both tourists and local residents, who come to enjoy its beautiful gardens, attend events and exhibitions, and participate in educational programs. Slotskogen Forest Park Slotskogen Forest Park is a public park located in Gothenburg, Sweden. It is one of the largest and most popular parks in the city, covering an area of approximately 55 hectares. The park was established in the late 19th century and is known for its large and well-preserved green spaces, which include meadows, forests, and lakes. Slotskogen is also home to a variety of wildlife, including birds, squirrels, and rabbits. In addition to being a popular place for recreation and relaxation, the park also hosts a variety of cultural events, such as concerts and festivals, throughout the year. Slotskogen Forest Park is a popular destination for both tourists and local residents, who come to enjoy its beautiful landscapes and outdoor activities. Finally, Drottningholm Palace. Drottningholm Palace is a royal palace located in Stockholm, Sweden. It is the residence of the Swedish royal family and is considered one of the best preserved royal palaces in the world. The palace, built in the 17th century, is a UNESCO World Heritage Site and is noted for its beautiful Baroque architecture and magnificent gardens. Mm -hmm.